Hey friends and welcome back to my channel. This video is all about fixing the issue with GTA 5 which is not launching in your Windows PC or you are getting an error. This game is already running or unable to launch the game whenever you are trying to launch that. So without wasting time, let's go ahead and directly proceed with the resolution. First of all in the basic step, right click on taskbar and choose the option task manager. Now here in the left pane, click on the startup tabs. Over here, find a service name with the name OneDrive. I have not installed OneDrive, that's why it is not showing right over here. So if OneDrive is available, you need to right click on it and choose the option enable. Make sure OneDrive is running as soon as you start your PC by choosing this particular enable option. Once it is done, restart your PC and try to launch the game. And nextly is right click on the shortcut icon of GTA 5 and choose the option properties. Click on compatibility tab and make sure to check mark this particular option, run this program as an administrator. Hit apply and ok button. And thirdly is again head over to this PC in this left pane. Again if you have OneDrive installed in your PC, click on that OneDrive option and in OneDrive you will find a folder with the name Rockstar Games. You need to go ahead and delete Rockstar Games folder. Once you have done these three things, make sure to restart your PC and then launch the game to fix out the issue of GTA 5 not launching in your Windows PC using Steam or Epic Launcher. If this failed to work out, let's proceed to the next step. In next step, if you are using Nahimic Audio in MSI, make sure you disable Nahimic Audio. To do so, right click on Start menu and choose option Run. Type here services.msc and then hit the Enter key. In this services menu, you will find Nahimic Audio if you press the N alphabet from the system. Once you found, right click on that and choose option properties. From here, service status, you need to stop it and under the startup type, you need to make it disable. Once you have done these changes, hit apply and ok button. Now go ahead and relaunch the game to fix out GTA 5 not launching or you are getting the error of this game is already running. If this also failed, in third step, right click on start menu and choose option run. Type here percentage local app data percentage and then hit the enter key. Over here you need to find a folder with the name Rockstar Game. You need to right click on this folder and choose the option rename and give it a name Rockstar Games 123 and hit the enter key. Now go ahead, close it, relaunch the GTA application and this will completely fix out the issue of GTA 5 not launching or this game is already running error in your Windows PC. So as of now, this is all about it friends, if this video works out for you, I request you to please click on subscribe button and turn on the bell notification icon to continue receiving updates from my channel. Thank you so much friends, thank you for watching.